Hi girls, Deb here with another video. So I want to thank you for all of your lovely comments from yesterday. I really appreciate that. And I wanted to follow up on, uh, there were a couple of comments about, well, how do you go to the bathroom in the jumpsuit? <laughs> and as I did reply, a uh, couple of ways, you could just pull it down like you would any other jumpsuit, or you do have the ability to go in and undo a couple of bunny ears and go that way as if you were wearing a skirt. So what I wanted to go over today is another way that Joanne had talked about and she said, well, you could just take the harem pants and wear it with a top and then you would have two pieces and you would just take them off like regular pants, which is a great idea, of course. And so I thought today I would just show you the just traditional harem pant and also how you could style another hypnotize ties as a top. So uh, this is um, my tube. This is a midi today that I've stepped into and I've got the little bunny ears in the bottom here to create the, the leg holes. And then what I've done with the pant is I have got a little extra folded over here, the top, and you're just gonna take one band and make a couple bunny ears right here to snug up your waist like so and then this extra fabric you can fold it over you have to tuck those bunny ears in fold it over and make this nice little drape you can kind of see that maybe I should wear a lighter color it might be a little easier for you to see but one way to fasten other than using the bunny ears that I like to do, and again, I, this was not my original idea, I got this from somebody else, is take a button. This is just your standard, well, it's a rather large one. This is probably a little, about the size of a 50 cent piece, I guess. So you take a button, and you're gonna stick that underneath both sets of your fabric. And then take a band, and you're gonna snug that up around the base of the button. And then you have no bunny ears and you have this cute little button detail. Okay? Now, to do a top, so I have a mini here. And as many of you have mentioned, you were looking for other ways that you could do the tops that didn't require that you wear a strapless. And so I think I have a way here that that would work. And so what I've done is the tube is just folded in half, the seam is in the back. I fold it down at the top a little bit. And I've already attached one arm and I'm gonna show you how I did that using the button method again. So the way this works is same exact principle. So if you're going to have this is going to be the back, and this is going to be your armhole, just find a spot kind of where you want your neckline to fall, usually a couple of inches off center seems to work just like that. And then again, you're gonna go in and take a button. This is a little bit smaller one. Place it under both sides of your fabric, like so. And then take your band, snug it up, just like that. I've got one on either side now. And then I'm just gonna put this on as I would tank top. And then you could easily wear this with a standard bra. And then you can tuck it in part way or you can tuck it in all the way. Mm -hmm. 
And I shortened up this mini quite a bit just by folding the fabric on the inside. And there you have it. You have harem pants made from Hypnot Ties and you have a nice little tank top from Hypnot Ties as well. Thank you. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye.